crazy and I'm so emotional and you guys are gonna hear this the entire time that you're traveling probably um, like I said we've got all resolved yesterday so I am going this um, I'm gonna go on my trip I just thought I wasn't gonna be able to go but I'm gonna be able to go so we got it all resolved <laughs> You guys, I'm so annoyed right now. I don't know if I'll again insert this in my vlog. I'm angry, but I'm also like, of course this would happen. You know, whenever you feel like that, like you feel angry, but like you can't even get angry because you just like, you knew something would happen. So I'm stuck here. Thinking about all the things that I could do. <sighs> so, here's the situation. My ex, the kids' dad was going to watch them while I go on this business trip. And he was supposed to come back yesterday, and then now it's today, and he was supposed to be here today. And I texted him, like, around 8, because I'm like, oh, it's late. You know, I texted him in the morning. I was like, what time are you going to be here? And he's like, I don't know. And then I texted him, like, at 8, and I was like, are you here? Because I hadn't heard anything from him. Um, and then for his, like, personal thing, well, he couldn't. Something happened, and he's not here. And I leave in a few hours to go get on an airplane. <sighs> but here I am stuck in a situation that I don't know what to do. Like... Okay guys, so we got things figured out. I don't feel as bad, but it did take a car ride and crying and like being angry and then having to go talk to my friend, my really good friend. So I did that and then I feel better. We got it figured out and I will be leaving in a few hours. It's 11, I drop one, two, three, four. I'm leaving in five hours. So I'm gonna try to finish packing up and then go clean up a little bit downstairs, make sure it's clean for the kids, um, and I'm gonna change to go to the airport, and I'm so nervous, I don't know what to do, my tummy hurts, um, but definitely after that, I was not able to sleep, right, so I didn't go to sleep till like one something in the morning, um, which I mean is fine, I'm not complaining, it just sucks that I went to sleep so late, I'm gonna be so tired, but I'm also gonna have like, today to rest because I don't work till tomorrow so I'll be able to rest today and then um, get up probably super early tomorrow and work I'm just heading to put some gas in my car and then run to the airport because I really need to get there to get some allergy medicine because I'm feeling sick but I think it's just my allergies my nose is like really itchy and stuffy and I'm just ugh, I just don't feel the best so I'm take some of this I also 
also got these to try out. Okay guys, it's about 9.15 now and I just ate some food. I'm watching some TV, let me turn it down. Freezing and I was like trying to figure out how to turn down the air because it was freezing and I put like this towel over it because it wouldn't stop blowing. <laughs> and then it says this, but I didn't understand it. I thought, I don't know, I'm dumb sometimes. I don't understand things. <laughs> it was 69 degrees in my room. It was freezing. So I put it up to 74. Took a shower, ate some Jimmy John's. I'm now I'm eating some of my chips and sipping on my drink. Hopefully I can warm up because I'm freezing. Woo! Good night, guys. See you tomorrow. Hi guys, so this is like day four of me being on this trip. I haven't really vlogged the past few days ever since I got here because honestly, it's all been work. Come to my hotel, go to sleep, wake up, work, come back, like it's just long hours of working and hard work. So, how many times did I say work? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, but today is Saturday. Last night I went out with my friend and we had a few t a good time um, and we went out to um, just walk around downtown Champaign, Illinois is where I'm at. So um, I am going to stay and probably edit my video for like 30 minutes and then I'm going to get ready and we're going to go out tonight and I'm going to bring you guys along tonight because hey that's fun and it's Saturday so that's why um, it's super dark in my room if I turn the other way. So. We did some shopping, if you guys can see that. Um, and then I got this cute little jacket from Charlotte Russe. My camera's gonna die, dang it. It's from Charlotte Russe, and it's like an oversized long jacket. And I'm debating on whether, sorry, I'm debating on whether I wanna wear this out, like just button it all the way up and like kind of wear it out with some shoes that I got today. But it is a little chilly outside, so. I don't think I'm gonna do that. Um, let me show you guys what I got. I got a, I went to Sephora. We got, I got a face mask, which looks like this. And these are the creepiest masks ever, but I wanted to try them because I thought, hey, why not? And then I got this Sephora eyeliner that I might put on today. It's a mustard yellow color. Sorry, my lighting is so bad in here. Um, oh, and then I went to, shoe carnival and I got two ugh, shoes it was buy one get one free because they were on clearance so they're both the same type of shoe just different colors so I got this beautiful like rose gold color and they're the cutest things ever and then I got the suede black color and I got one for free like I said so we're gonna just leave that out so you guys can see just what I might wear today tonight um, I went to American Eagle and I didn't get clothes there but I got this little yo-yo for Anthony and it's one of the world's smallest little yo-yo things and Anthony's obsessed with yo-yo so I had to get him that I miss them so much you guys you guys don't understand how much I miss my babes so I'm just gonna that in there leave that for Anthony I went to forever 21 and this is what I'm gonna wear tonight yesterday I dressed up a little too much for dinner so I just kind of felt weird but um okay so this is actually a sports bra from forever 21 
but um i thought i could wear it like a cute little crop top with this jean jacket um and then some high-waisted either pants or leggings that i decided to get today too and then i'm gonna dress it up with some jewelry and so i have this little gold necklace right here and i got a whole bunch of gold jewelry yesterday just like cheap gold jewelry so i got like these little rings which you guys will see today and then i got this cute little thing at Gordsman. Um, and then I got a Charlotte Luce root. <laughs> Did I say Charlotte Luce? A Charlotte Ruth. I got this jacket for 20 bucks. It was on. I think I'm just going to wear these high waisted leggings that I got from Charlotte Ruth with that. And then my, uh, my jean jacket. And then one of these, I'm not sure which one I'm going to wear yet. I'm going to wear one of those shoes, which I probably be freezing in, but that's okay. I went to Aeropostale and I grabbed this shirt. It was on sale for 11 well it was on sale for $12 this is like 11 something isn't it the cutest little shirt ever it's a pajama shirt but hey I'm gonna wear it out and stuff it is the cutest thing ever Brittany and baby wore a shirt like this um for a video one time and I love the way it looked on her except she got it from like Urban Outfitters because she like even told us like on where she got it from and it was like so expensive so I was so bummed out that I just couldn't afford it and then these this one was originally, let's see how much, it was originally $40, but I got it for $11, like $12. Oh, I am probably going to beat my face today and uh, look super cute, probably do my hair and just have a good time tonight, but I'm going to bring you guys along. Okay, guys, so you guys rarely <laughs> see me like this, so I feel like I'm showing, like I'm like going, walking into a room full of my friends that have never seen me like this. But I'm running late, it's 8.37, and we're gonna head out. I don't feel like the most comfortable in my outfit, but I think I'll show you guys what's making it comfortable, because I usually don't dress uh, or look like this. I curled my hair, and it's so cute, is it not? Like, I love it, like here, just like the sass, my makeup. I just did something very, like, simple on the eyes. I don't know if you guys can see it. Put some dramatic lashes on, contour my lips a little bit, and we're good. I look so snatched. Okay, um, I did my nails. I told you guys that. And this is my outfit. I'm wearing the denim jacket from, what's it called? Um, Charlotte Ruth. Um, and then I'm wearing the like kind of sports bra. I would not wear this on its own, you guys. I'm just not very comfortable with my body. So I'm glad I did get the jacket for it. I was, And I'm glad I got it long enough because I was going to get a cropped one, but I didn't. Um, and then I'm wearing these leggings that honestly... They're not my favorite leggings because um, they're just, they don't suck anything in. So I still look a little chubs, which honestly it's my issue, not anybody else's. So, um, and then these are my shoes. Like I said, I was going between those rose gold and this one. But I think these look the best with the outfit. They're just like simple slip-on shoes. And then my jewelry, I got this. And then I got this bracelet right here. I have this little bracelet that I got from Forever 21. And then I have my cute little rings on my hands. Like that. And then I got my nails. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, so I'm going to head over to my friend. We're at 7 Saints. Look at this cute little lamp. Such a cute little menu. Look at the ceiling. I know, it's so cute. I have some bomb music. Hey guys, what's up? So I've just been in my room today all day. Well, I went out to, well, not, I'm not gonna open that window very much because I'm not wearing pants. So um, I've been in my room most of the day, but I also went out to get some lunch with my friend, but I do need to do laundry, which I'm still getting to it. Um, and I am just gonna relax and um, just, try to get ready for a full week of work tomorrow um, and for this week so um, I what I've been doing all day is I've been trying to get a video up for you guys which looks promising yeah yeah it looks so promising um, it are it's already at six percent so I'm so excited I was so nervous that this internet was gonna suck and take forever to upload my videos but girl it didn't ooh, 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 ooh. yeah yeah my room is a mess right now but it's fine. We're gonna do the little mask now. This is what the number one looks like in the thing. I'm just gonna kind of scrape it down. Okay. Okay. 
literally barely anything comes out all got the liquid in there it is blue okay then you close it to make sure you put your hand or finger over the hole and you shake it It says to set my timer for 15 minutes, which I will do. And it's just, it's kind of dripping everywhere, so I'm gonna go lay down. Okay, guys, so it's time to remove this, but I want you guys, this is like plot, like rubbery now. It's like a, like that nothing comes off. Not a little weird. So I wanna start from down here. Oh my gosh, that feels so good. Do you guys see how like it's kind of like I feel so nice to play with in general you guys see that I'm so gross I'm sorry okay, this isn't as easy as I thought it would be good morning guys so today it's an exciting day sorry to get on my jacket it's freezing but I just got to take off it's um opening day for our store i think i can totally vlog for you guys and maybe show you guys what i did at my store um so first like the first week and a half that you're here you literally work your ass off um with getting product in the store and putting product out and um things like that it's just like working if you've ever done truck like um for a retail store um uh, it's like a truck times 100 there's so much product that you have to put out because the store is completely empty there's so many things that you need to rearrange there's it's just very time consuming and i was over the accessories this store opening so i'm i was excited that i was over something because i honestly expected to come to this store opening and kind of like do truck and be with like all the other sales advisors but i wasn't i was over accessories so that means i had my department i know it's like it's considered a department so I had to be over like all of that and then um it was definitely stressful and there was like yesterday i think yesterday i was just done like i was thankful that i could be here and do that but like i was just so done with accessories and then um i just don't think and i still have to go today and do a few changes like a few tweaks on the accessories but other than that i was just over it and i was just done um but I'm so proud of the work that I've done at that store. And so today we get to open it, we get to have fun, we actually get to relax and be in our like roles as sales advisors and then whatever else everyone is. Um, I'm pretty sure it'll still be hectic, it'll just be hectic in a different way. Um, because I wouldn't have to be like so obsessed with placing product and getting it right. So that's what you do in store openings. That's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna go get my face on and look hella cute for this opening, guys. And I'm gonna wear my outfit and I'm gonna be rocking it. Oh. Come through H and net. Always my forehead. Why? It always lands oh on my forehead. Yes. <laughs> Would you get cheddar? Yeah. Always. Why does it do this to me? It always turns around to my face. pretty late in the morning I went out last night um, with my friends and had a good time so that's that was fun but it's my day off good thing I don't have to work today um, I'm exhausted still what time is it it's 10 30 <laughs> I've been up though since like 8 I just been lying around forever um, today I have to go and pick up some clothes from H. What's, what's the one that you ordered? 
watermelon. Oh, watermelon. Yeah. 